Hello once again, all you lovely people out there in the land of the Tube of Views. It's me, the Gaming Nerd John, and we're continuing our travels through Citizen Sleeper, where I have way too many things to do. And clearly time is against me. But you know who isn't against me right now? Let me just get this face mask off here. <laughs> you son of a bitch! Uh, yeah, so... Uh, we have been informed by our good friend Ethan that says that <laughs> Big Bad Boy Maywick is on their way. We need to figure it out or die. Uh, that is a very hefty clock, though, so I feel pretty good about our chances. As long as we don't waste time. Yeah, well, why would we ever do that? Uh, so we've got two food, energy, whatever. I feel... Yeah, I feel pretty good. Uh, I think off camera we were talking about how we probably want to focus on our activities in the green way. Yeah. Um, how that's probably going to be our best bet uh, moving forward. Yeah. That is some good dice. I am not mad. All right, so let's get to the green way. Cross to the green way. sha ba ba -boo. All right, farm stacks, don't care. Um... Map? Oh, but walk the green way gets plus three. And also being in... No, it's engaged that gets us energy now. Yes. Yeah. But the issue is that we have four remaining. Yeah. So we might as well just, <clears throat> like, use our three here. Yeah, because I think we get something for into it, though. Uh, I think so. Yeah. Yeah, I'm fine with this. Ooh, risky. But we did it. Uh, and then just use the four, because then it'll become yeah. a five. Yeah. Sick. Okay. All right. Mushroom new, grows! New drive. Grow mushrooms. The aviary would be a perfect place to grow some mushrooms. With some work, that is. Why the aviary? I don't know. Mushroom groves, though. Yeah. I'm gonna check that out. Collect spores. Forage for fungus. Uh, caps. Jerol caps. Hello there. Oh, look at that. Mm, just saying. Just saying. But I think we needed three of them. That's fine. Which kind of sucks. I mean, this gets us started. Yeah. Uh, and then we'll need to eat food. Yes. Or do we want to work for food? Noodles. Noodles are always good. Because <laughs> that's 100% guaranteed. Yep. Because uh, otherwise we're spending money. Noodles win. Yeah. Yeah. You're right. Noodles. I'm all about them saucy nudes. Wait. Uh, hello? Yes. Yeah, and now we're breaking even on that. So, I feel pretty good about that. Yeah. Nice. Neutral. That's what we needed. Five cryo. Yeah. That helps. I'm not going to complain. Okay, so actually speaking of five cryo, do we want to feed the stray? <laughs> they are a cat after all. They are a cat. Like, I can't say no. Yeah. Bunk. The stray crunches up the crackers as you watch. Sometimes they let you stroke them. Sometimes not. That is a cat, all right. Mm -hmm. Cool. I think that's a good way to end the day. We're still going to have four dice. So that's good. Yo! Oh, damn! We'll save that six. We do need okay. to get money. I kind of wish they would just let us scroll. Yes! I mean, I get, like, the Thematically. Eye. No, the eye. Yeah, yeah, I yeah. get that. Because yeah. that's technically a separate section. Yeah, but this is, like, all connected. Yeah. Just let me let me do it. Uh, we'll use our five here. Yep. Actually, we could use both fives. Yeah. And then that would get us the caps that we need. Yeah. 
That'll get us another drive completed, hopefully. All right, back we go. And you know what? Actually, I am curious. Yeah, let's what does this at look like? That. Clear overgrowth. Good. Uh, I mean, plus three, because that's another like, twelve. It looks like it doesn't matter. We always get something. something. Yeah. So let's think about it. Anyway, back. We're not losing a, a number on that because uh, being being it was yep. indoor, we we don't have that penalty anymore. Yeah. Emphasis stall. Yes. Yes. Emphasis eagerly takes the bright yellow Jerol caps. He seems pleased with them. Huh? You gotta be kidding me. We gotta wait. He doesn't like to rush these things. Oh, we lose the ability to buy. <laughs> At least we have the noodle place. We do have the noodle place. All right, let's think. What do we <clears throat> do? We want to use that six to. We gotta. Do, we gotta. Because like, there's there's multiple options here, right? Like we have multiple choices. I mean, I don't think the game is gonna end if we just get protection. I don't think so. But I think we do. We get no. We don't get cryo out of that, do we? I don't think so. Let's take a look. Uh, there, yeah. yeah. But it is engaged. At least the the other side is. Yeah. That's true. We could use a six there. Yeah. We might actually get energy back from this. Fingers crossed. Nope. Damn. Uh, that's okay. Alright, so let's think. Where do we want to use this three? Because we need money. This wasn't the place. Uh, no, play the exchange. Actually, we also need food. We do also need food, and we can't buy food. Well, not from the mushroom place. I think we could technically go to... We could go to the one spot. The bar or the farm. Yeah. Uh, I think we should just work. But honestly, yeah. This has been... This has been a good spot for us. Yeah. Noodles are Look always good. Look at that, good. plus five. Okay. Feed the cat again. No. <laughs> I, I, I know... I... But I want the cat! <laughs> <laughs> it's fine. It's fine. We don't have to. Yeah. I'll uh, wait until we uh, stabilize. Yeah. All right. End cycle. We do, we've we've gotten some... Okay, I know I just screwed we, myself uh, by thinking it, but like we've gotten some good rolls. Oh, whew, okay. Yeah. All right, so we got the Jerol caps. What else can we work on? Uh, let's see. There was because, like, I, I I feel like so like sure we could do the stuff up here, but like that's unlocking an entirely new area. I just don't unless we want to see what it does. I don't know. I don't think it's worth it. Mike, here's my question. When do we want to try Feng's thing? Oh, that's a good point. Because we do... We're going to be down to... We're going to be down to three dice starting next round. Yeah. So we need to make money. Yeah. And we need six cycles at most. Yeah. To do Feng's thing. That's, that's what it seemed like. So, like... Do we... Is this a way to get money? Uh, technically, yes, yeah. We do have a six. We could. Yeah. We could. It's 100% guaranteed with a six. Yeah. 100% chance. Yeah. And that gets us all our energy back. That lets us have three actions to do other stuff. Yeah. I think that's the right call. Oh, that did not go up. And look at that. We also got extra energy. <laughs> Thanks, game. Thanks. The one time it actually triggered. Uh, <laughs> yeah, that's not rude. Uh, okay, so that basically says only throw sixes at that. Yeah, pretty much. Uh, I mean, that's fine. Like, whatever. Yeah. Okay. 
What else was here? So let us get spores. Uh, spores provide a chance to gather or study these specimens. But what are we untouched for? But like, what are they used for? Yeah. I don't think we need any of that. I think the aviary might be where we use the seed. I agree. It's just that takes so much effort. That's 12 to clear that. The highest we can get is plus three. Yeah. Okay. Uh, Do we want to just work on clearing off the debt? Uh, something. Just make sure we do something that gets us money. Yeah, I mean, we've got threes. So, like, yeah. we could do... Um, what's the team? I want to say this might be the last cycle with four dice. Yeah. So, like, we've got... What would that put it at? 25% chance of a bad result. I think that that's worth it. Ooh. Sure. Wasn't... Hit me. Wasn't somebody buying uh, a shit mine for 150 Yeah. And can't we get a shit mine from Caster? Yeah. We'd have to hack. Yeah. Twice. Uh, we would need... Uh, Haven what, Age. Haven Age? Yeah. Uh, Haven Age. Yeah. It does take a three. Yeah. Toss a three on there. Sure. Did we get a perk right there? I think we got a perk. Well... No, because I don't think that was plus five. No. All right. I don't know what that note is. It does not want to... Yeah, it doesn't want to let us know. Uh, but there's another Haven Age. Yeah. yeah let's do that. Come on, be a three. Look at that. There, we can throw our threes at it. Yeah. Please. Perfect. That's exactly what... Good call, dude. Good shot. Because we were getting, like, two each. Yeah, now, I think yeah. this is only something we can do once. Yeah. I think you're right. I mean, hell, I might unlock something for, uh... For Caster. Like, uh, yeah, let's take a look. Nothing. Yeah, not right now. That's fine. But I think it was... I think it's this one. Yeah, right yeah. there. Buy shit mine core. Oh, wait. Oh, wait, no. Wait. There it is. Yeah, sell ship mind. Whew. Okay. Now, freaking Masatake. Yeah, Masatake caps. Yeah. One fitty. I'll take it. Okay. There so, we go. Now, we, we now, almost have 200, dude. Now I feel a lot more comfortable. There we go. Oh, we could buy the stabilizer. Technically, yes. Because it's just an item. Yeah. Well, well, I don't know if it's an item coming from her. No, it is. Yeah. Acquire stabilizer. Yeah, true. Vial by vial. Ta-da. Okay, yeah. Nice. Yep. As you quickly leave the surgery, eager to be away from Toshiro's glare, <laughs> you notice something wrapped around the stabilizer vial clutched tightly in your hand. You open your hand, and a thin film marked with holes and sigils unrolls from around the vial. At one end, it has a hard metal strip, a handle. Check the film. You hold the cloudy film up to the light. It is perforated with an ornate pattern of holes. You can make out a word among the markings. Pass key. Is this an entry key for something? Inspect the handle. The metal handle is worn and pitted, but you can see a set of numbers imprinted into it. 207-F. And then crudely scratched into the handle at some later date. Low end. Continue. For a moment, you consider going back to the surgery to return the key, and then quickly think better of it. Did Sabine want you to have this? Or is Toshiro passing on a message? T 
Time to head to low end and find out. Yes! <laughs> I think we want to do plus one for engage, right? That's what we were thinking. Because otherwise it's photosynthetic. Yeah, stuff. no, no, no. Because, yeah, that SF Hagler is going to be great. Yeah, that will help us out tremendously. So then we just need two points. All right. That feels good. I knew it. I knew that would do the trick. Hey, new, new uh, spot up there. You're right. Unit 207-F. Unlock apartment. You find the entrance to the apartment. It's passkey symbol obscured beneath layers of graffiti. Who lives here? The lock clunks open. The metal door is swinging inward into the dark. Show them why. As you push the door open, the automatic lights flicker on inside the apartment. They reveal yellowing plastic panels, much like a Super Nintendo. <laughs> the curved shape of wall-mounted utility units. The detritus of a routine life arranged on every surface. You step inside, clicking the door shut behind. The amber light of the aging fixtures glaze everything with pale orange. The work surface holds a variety of objects indistinct in the dull lighting. A pale blue light drifts from a doorway at the end of the room. Ooh, I don't know. Ah. I'm going to inspect the surface. Smudges through the thin layer of dust suggest a recent, rare, and hurried visit. They trace a path to the water dispenser, the auto wash, then to a cabinet still half open. On the shelf sits an empty pill case. Go to the doorway. You cross the cramped utility room with its auto wash, dispensers, water closet, towards the doorway. Through the doorway is a dark, warm room, lit only by the faint glow of a terminal screen. Why do, the room. do this? Yeah, we gotta look in the room. A bunk is tucked into the wall. The blankets ruffled. A wall desk glitters with rows of vials and containers. A briefcase lab sits open loaded with rows of reagents and compounds you do not recognize. In comparison, this room is clean, ordered, controlled. Approach the ter terminal. Where did that egg come from? As you approach, there is a crackle from somewhere in the dark. Sleeper. Sabine's voice shakily echoes through the apartment. Welcome to my home. I'm sorry I can't be there. I've had to make alternate arrangements. You hear rattling noises, static. I was able to record this message, but I don't dare to show my face. Something is happening within Yadigan. I no longer trust them. Their voice becomes distant, slipping behind the background noise. I have something to ask of you. I want you to get me out. Yadigan were supposed to hide me, to protect me. After everything that happened, I was desperate. And then after that, I was too tired to care. A noise like waves passes over the recording. But I'm done with them now. I want out. Screw the debt. But I need insurance. Something I can hold against them. I have my suspicions. But I can't be sure. I need information. And as you know, you need me. A pause. Something clicking in the dark. This isn't a threat. You have to understand my position here. Another pause. I know, sleepers. I've been here before. I can help you, but not with Yadigan's noose around my neck. Get me data. Get me information. Get me something that I can use against Yadigan. Then I can get out, and you can get what you need. Please. Waves of static cut into Sabine's voice. Bring it here to my terminal. I'll get to it when I can. You look around the tiny room and try to imagine Sabine living here, working at the desk, sleeping in the bunk, <coughs> blinking into the terminal in the dark. The recording cuts to static, filling the room with its white hiss. Then, silence. Why can we still access the trunk? Yeah. You sit in front of the humming terminal and hit a few keys. Sabine has left an access port open, but the rest is encrypted, locked away behind passcodes. It seems Sabine might not trust you as much as they want you to think. 
Who does Sabine need to hide from? And what debt do they owe to Yadigan? You try to assemble the pieces, but too many are missing. The only thing you know is that without Stabilizer, your body will die. You glance at the briefcase lamp on the desk, its glassware glinting in the dark. You turn away and leave, the door clunking shut behind you. Back in the corridor, you notice the scrawled graffiti of a blade on the opposite wall. Yadigan. You feel yourself being drawn into something you don't quite understand. Hmm. What else is now? New drive discovered! Great! Uh, this again... Okay, so now that all the background noise has finally ended, hopefully, yeah, uh, we can really. kind of continue our eternal debate. So we got the stabilizer, we have more drives, just what we needed. Um, we gotta wait well, for Emphis. One finished, it looked like, so... Yeah, yeah, yeah. We just replaced one with another. Yeah, we, we got a point, though, which yes. is it's good. Um, we so we still got one. a five. What else can we work towards? So, we don't want to start the Crack Conway thing. Nope, not until we are absolutely sure we want to do that. the green wave. Find a nurturing grow bed for the seeds. Aviary. Yeah, it's the aviary. We don't care about flotilla aid. We could work on getting rid of Ethan's debt. Yeah. I mean, as much as I hate that asshole. Is it? No, it's further up. Yeah. Yeah. It'd be 100% guaranteed now. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Damn it. <laughs> I hate that guy. Cool. Alright. So we're four twelfths of the way there. We're a third of the way. We do have stabilizer. We've got a seed. Like, I, I feel okay. Like, we've been in worse situations. Yeah, okay. Uh, what is it? Next turn we're going to only have three? Yep. So I think we wait until we're about to have two, and then we stabilize. And if we haven't gotten anything further along, then yeah. we can start Fang's yeah. quest. Oh, right. But I could feed the stray. Oh, we bought the thing. Yeah. I'm 100% feeding the stray. Oh, yeah. Stray fed. Nothing? Nope. Nothing? <laughs> okay. What do we got? It's a pretty good dice still. Yeah. I'm not upset. Okay, so we got a six. Do we want to... Because we've got the plus ones, so we could use our threes for the Compressor Club. Yeah. We've hacked all the internets. Wow, well, we're going to have to hack some more. Yeah. We've hacked all the current internets. What? Yeah. Hmm? Shipmine Fragment. Yeah, we don't care about that now. What are we going to do with it? At like, the what's... moment, nothing. Yeah, there's nothing... Because I think only the Ambergris may need it. May need it, yeah, exactly. Um, we could also start clearing out the uh, aviary. I'm probably going to do that. Yeah, with the six that we got? Yeah. Yeah. Because, like, what is it? Farm stacks? We could work the stacks. Who cares? We don't need money. For once. For a little bit. For a little while, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Yes. Because I don't feel good about using a three here. Yeah. I don't think, like, we're not going to get the plus one for for that. Is there anything on here? <laughs> I just don't think it's worth it right now. There's Question. too much. Yeah. We had a section for the wastes. Yeah. Is that another unlock areas thing? We, we can't, can't even it. do it. Yeah. Gather scrap. We need to get a plus one on endure. So we don't even have, like, the capacity to do that. I say we just work off the debt. Yeah. 
We get a plus one on it. 25% chance of a negative. It's not terrible. Emphasis next turn. Come on, don't suck. Yes! Minus condition. Yikes. Plus energy. Yeah, but we would rather have... Yeah, true. We would rather have the reverse. <laughs> Honestly, though, the thing is, 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 like, it's... It's okay. We have the state. God bless! Uh, this is just going to accelerate that. Yeah! Yeah, you're not wrong! God damn, that's Ooh, two Wow! Points. That was two 25ers. I need to feed a cat to feel better. Meow. Nothing? Oh, what do you know? That cat also doesn't love me. Uh, oh, God, that was brutal. I mean, yes, that's going to save us money. Yeah. But, like, minus two condition is basically the same as losing money. Oh, well, that's good. That'll help us. Yeah, I guess we clear away some more. Yeah. Uh, sixer... Because even a 5 is positive or neutral. Yeah. Like, it's still worthwhile, in my opinion. Yeah, that's not terrible. Yeah. I still feel good about that. And then we work off more debt. And apparently shoot ourselves in the face. Well, uh, that should uh, finish whoa, 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 wait, 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 Okay, here's the thing. Talk to him. Yeah, let's do that first. Emphis is preparing the Jirol caps. He has had to heavily adapt this recipe, he says, but the smell is already incredible. It emanates from a strange purplish-white bulb you have never seen before, and he is slicing it finely. That's called an onion. He brushes and slices the mushrooms, and then places them in the wok with the sliced bulb and the oil. They caramelize there in that well-worn crucible. He adds liquids, transparent and opaque, and then turns down the heat. A sprinkle of leaves is the final touch. We have a moment, sleeper. He smiles. Do you have a story? Something in the scent of the food gives you a feeling of nostalgia, something distant and melancholic. It seems like the story should match that feeling somehow, and maybe you'll feel better for telling it. Recall your oldest memories. You start by explaining that when you are emulated from a person, many of your memories are left behind. Perhaps it is an intentional part of the process, a way of keeping sleepers ignorant and malleable, or perhaps it is a side effect of the imperfect emulation. You admit that you don't really know. What you do know is that some memories survive, and that on occasion they come back to you, like shadows passing overhead. You detail one recurrent memory, which despite returning to you with enough regularity for you to think it familiar, always fades as quickly as it arrives. You struggle to explain the feeling of being whole for a moment that comes with this memory, and then how that wholeness slips away to leave you feeling like you've forgotten something important, but just can't bring it to mind. Emphis nods throughout cooking, as he does, with deft and skillful movements. You start to trail off when you realize you can't find the words to explain how the memories you do have feel like both yours and someone else's at the same time, and how that always fills you with a certain sadness. The sadness of remaining forever unknown, even to yourself. Empus finishes cooking and meets your eye. I'm sorry, sleeper, for your troubles. He puts the walk to one side. I appreciate you sharing with me. He smiles. I hope it lightens you a little. He passes you a bowl and heaps the jerolles into it, their yellow color mixing with the pale sauce in whorls and blooms. Eat. The dish is delicious. Filling. It warms you as you eat it in a way you weren't even sure your body could be warmed. It is a small mercy, you think, 
that SNARP left you this pleasure. Many of the features of frames are there to simulate human experience. You know that much. Emulated minds can't be rewired, so their need for embodied experience must be met. This is why you breathe even when you do not need air. Without that simulation, the sensation of drowning would be unbearable. Food serves another purpose. Your frame is able to metabolize it to produce energy from the raw material. Vitamins and minerals are excess, of course. Your frame only needs raw power, so much is wasted. And yet, while you eat this food and feel that warmth, nothing feels wasted. It all means something to you. As you finish, Emphis takes the bowl, the last of his cleaning. He smiles at you, and neither of you feel the need to say anything more. Instead, you simply exchange nods and walk your separate ways back into the bright market. Somehow changed. Ho! Oh, hey! Matsutake Baroth. Nice. Where the fuck do we get that shit? Because that's like the second place it needs it. Get to know Empress. <laughs> yep. <laughs> shit! We didn't get another point out of this? Damn. Ah, crack a jacks. I mean, hold up, hold up. Let's go back to the Greenway. The other one was not those, though. It was for spores. Yeah. Well, grove spores. Well, what do we use grove spores for? I don't know. I mean, we do have a three. Fuck it. Go for it. Because we're going to have to inject ourselves. Yeah. Otherwise, we're in bad shape. Grove spores. Neutral. What is it? A cocktail of unknown spores gathered from the Greenway Groves. Cool! All right. Why not? Uh, I guess I'll have us go back and inject. Yeah. And then we'll uh, call it there that way. We aren't to hello, hello, hello. Well, actually, I'm gonna feed the stray first. Who am I getting? Ease. Inject. Let's do it. Condition stabilized. Body repaired. We're fully stable and fully fed. It has been a long time since that has been the yep. case. A long time. Um, but you know what doesn't take a long time? Hitting that like and subscribe button as well as that bell notification so YouTube will inform you of when more of this wonderful little series continues. Thank you all so much for watching. Hope you are enjoying. And as always, until next time, take it easy. I think I'm going to go to bed. What? <laughs>